Hey everybody, we are in the Honey Hole at Independent Ranch. Natalia is taping. Yep. So we're about to get her stand all set up and hopefully we can bag a big pig today, right? Right. You gonna eat a big one? Yeah. Grandpa, do you think I'll get a big pig? 300 pounds at least. You be bringing home the bacon, baby. <laughs> okay, stop recording. Okay, that's enough. We, we need to save room for it. Okay, Natalia, are you ready? Yeah. You ready to shoot some hogs? Grandpa. Looking good over there, Grandpa. You ready? All right. I sure am glad to be here. Um, the place I'd rather be. Okay, so now we have to be quiet. I'm gonna get my gun set up. Keep your eyes open for hogs, okay? And here we are in the honey hole. Beautiful breeze in our favor, and we're gonna try to bag some hogs. Okay, in this video, <clears throat> using thermals during the day, a big sounder came in with a big mama sow, and uh, she ended up seeing me, so I took a shot running, bam. I took another shot at her running, and that one must have hit her in the spine because a couple seconds later she drops, and I knew I hit her two times with solid shots, and she falls over right there by the tree. Just a, a beautiful shot. All right, and so I did one more to finish it off. So. <clears throat> Here's me with the sow. Go What do you think? Yeah, is that really is that a cool. big one or what? That's a big sow, and this sow's pregnant. She's got a bunch of babies in there. That is one big pig. It turned off. It's gonna. It only because it, it times out. So I want you to get go over there and stand by. Okay. That's close to 200, isn't it? It's 175 <laughs> in that range. Just kneel down by it, honey. Kneel down. Kneel, kneel down so we can see how big the pig is. I can't tell by you standing. All right, what do you think? Pretty big. That's a big pig. All right, so daddy got his. Now we got to make sure that you guys get yours. All right. So I think I'm going to, I don't think we need to call Matt yet, do we? Wait I, would, I would call him, let him come. Let's Scare him all this way. Before someone else claims him. Okay. All right, so I'm going to call Matt to come and get him. And then hopefully that doesn't mess up you guys over there. Because yeah. I, I think something's going to come this way. I think so. But you keep making that call, and they're going to keep coming. Let me tell you something. They weren't scared of that call. She's going, rawr, 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 and I see them going, just looking. I, I went over there. I said, show me how to do that. So she showed me. I said, can I try it? And she's like, she is tight. Yeah, she, she now this time I spotted a big sounder coming into my right hand side and I spotted a nice boar and I knew I was only going to get one shot at this um, and there were trees so I planned my shot I was going to let the smaller one walk forward first and then I was going to shoot the big boar in between the trees so that's basically what I did I let the first one go through he comes through bam and I basically finish him off two shots he goes down I'm using 129 grain Hornady SSD for my Creedmoor and those bullets are absolutely deadly the, the wound on the exit wound on this thing was just crazy I'm surprised he's even kicking but uh, anyway that's the big boar in the honey hole to be continued
Okay, so here's another one. Yeah, it's about uh, 185, I'd say. Yeah, he's he's creeping up on the 200s. And this pig had tusks, even though it's a. I see them. It's a, it's a male, but his tusks broke. He, fighting. But that's a that's a mighty nice pig right there. Absolutely. Do I gotta do anything? Nope. I do nothing. I just see you in there. Just point. Look at it. Yeah, there it is, Jay. That's a beauty. So, how many yards were you away from that one? Oh my gun. Where my gun is? A little under 100 yards. Right, 80, something like that. Yeah. Yep. I just aimed a little bit lower and. Hit and I know. I know. I hit him. I hit him in this area here, and then I finished him off with a bullet on the other side. Yeah. This. This is a nice. Big fat pig. You got me on there? Got you, man. All right. You Red come? light just went out. Okay, it's all right. Want all me right. to help you drag him no, over? No, you're still taping. Press the red button. That's the same thing you did. <laughs> all right, it went off. Did it? Yeah, the little red light. Oh, no. So, Dad shot a nice one right as it was coming down. Didn't even. Oh, just finished him off. So we're going down there right now just to make sure he's down and he looks like a monster. So, yeah, he looks nice. But yeah, Dad got the first crack at the biggest one coming around the corner. Looks like a nice one to be continued. Yeah, there we go. Grandpa got a nice one. We are at the honey hole. That's right, he was still kicking a little bit. So I had to use my 45. Put him down Finish so he him doesn't up. suffer. All right, nice pig, Dad. It's good size, maybe 140 to 160, I'm thinking. Yeah, he's nice. That's good eating, and the shot placement was awesome. He kind of made sure he wasn't going anywhere, and he didn't. He took a couple steps and dropped right through the heart. Okay, guys will be on their way in a couple minutes. So, Tally, what? are you ready to shoot some more hogs tonight? Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is our final night at Independence Ranch, and we're going to go back to a windmill, and Natalia is going to be shooting the first pig tonight, so we're going to get that video ready to go. All right, give, give me some thumbs up. Thank you. All right, love you. Okay, in this video, <clears throat> there was a bunch of pigs, and we both had our mark on a pig. Uh, this one was doing a little sniffing, so I thought it was a perfect time to get that beautiful shot. So I put him down. Um, I decided to take another shot here. Two. Definitely hit it. Bleeding. Three. You want to talk about one tough animal. Um, I had five shots in this animal when we tracked it. And he ran about 300 yards into the woods. But then doubled back and ended up on the road. So uh, what a tough animal. But uh, yeah, ended up shooting two um, in that scenario right there. I'm doing a voiceover on this because my daughter thinks she misses. I shoot the pig in the front, but there's a pig behind it. She actually shoots the pig next to mine, and the pig drops. Take a look, and I think you'll see exactly what I see. There's two pigs there, and two pigs go down. She shoots, I shoot. I shot low, she shot high, and we end up killing two pigs with one shot. Um, and then, of course, Tally took another shot at that one with me, helping me out. I mean, between the both of us, we put six shots in that animal that uh, that ran off. But, yeah, we ended up killing um, two pigs by aiming for the same pig, which was kind of crazy. And I think uh, when she sees this video, she's definitely going to get a kick out of that. Um, but in this one scenario, you end up shooting seven pigs. Uh, my dad shot three on the other side, um, and then I was able to take another shot on one running across. Uh, but it didn't, uh, the video didn't come out too good because I had it on 12 times. All right, so to be continued. The next one, we're at the end of the night, so my dad decides to take a shot. I also take one on the other side. Uh, his pig goes down, so does mine. Um, he decides to take a couple more shots here at this pig, but it's so close, he goes right over the, he goes right over the back. Um, but uh, to be continued.
in this one to end the night we wanted to do a three-way synchronized shot and we each take a shot i take one mine goes down my dad took one his went down natalia hit this one in the rear and uh all three of us basically finished this pig off to uh end our night out at independence ranch um stay tuned after the videos here we are going to have some pictures posted and uh what a great time we ended up shooting 17 pigs a total of 2400 pounds worth of meat out at independence ranch um, it was a great time and to be continued I want to dedicate this video to my daughter shooting her gun at the range pointing to her heat pad at 100 yards look at that 100 yard shots my daughter with her grandpa who came from Vegas to hunt with us especially her first pig that I hope she'll never forget I'll never forget it a second picture of that first pig she ever shot two more pigs that she laid down like a champ her with the stuffed pig at the ranch and of course her five pigs I love you sweetheart it's dedicated to you